First of all, who thought Sarah's vows were cheesy? I did. Michael, I've only met you a handful of times, but I have to know that I feel like I know you pretty well just because we are here. Because honestly, it takes the best kind of man to love Sada. Thank you all for welcoming us. Michael, I know you're going to be a sincere, caring, loving husband to my friend. I love you guys so much. She always used to say, I'm going to marry a guy whose chest will block out the sun and be able to beat up my brothers. I never thought that you know, I'd have two empty chairs. That sucks. But what really is amazing is how all of you are here today. And all of you have shown my family so much love. I'd like to propose a toast, please, to Sarah and Michael. great as this night is meant to be for everyone involved, there are two empty seats in this hall, in our hearts, in our minds, for our parents. I know without a doubt, they are amongst us this evening, enjoying it in their own way. With this ring, I do promise to love you unconditionally and make tomorrow, each tomorrow, the best it can be. Who fell in love first? I'm blessed. I really, really am. Michael is more blessed because he has me. When the one whom you believe in puts their faith and trust in you, you found the one and only love. You'll change your whole life. I will care for you, stand beside you, and share with you all of life's adversities and all of its joys from this day forward. Michael and Sarah, you've given your vows and promises to each other in the presence of your families and your friends. I wish for you an eternity of love, health, laughter, and happy ever after. And I'm very pleased to announce you as husband and wife. Now you can kiss your brother. Separate